Hey, what's going on, everybody? I'm Louis Phantom here. Chris, I'm joined by my lovely girlfriend, Maya. And, uh, yeah, we got the uh, Monday Showdown Vampire Tournament. And uh, I can't take credit for this one. I mean, I guess I kind of can, but this was actually my boy Santarium's uh, win. Uh, but he never claimed his try, so we had to go on. So I went ahead and picked in his place. Uh, but this, I'm not the champion or anything like that. Uh, not a win for me. It's a win for him. So, all right. So let's jump into this. I just said vampires didn't matter who, what. Let's just jump in there and do this thing. Uh, fam, don't have his contacts in, so I'm gonna have to phew, read it like this. All right. The first match: Blade, Wesley Snipes from the Blade series, uh, thrown in there by Random Ross, going up against Richie Gecko, Quentin Tarantino. From dusk till dawn. So I'll let you go first on this one. Probably should have brought a pin. So what? I don't have a pin. Blade versus Richie Gecko. Uh, um, I guess Richie Gecko. You know Richie Gecko? Alright. Mm -hmm. I, I don't know who that is though. I seen the the, the dusk till dawn. Who's that you know? George Clooney's brother. The one who gets fucking like, you know, shot in the hand and he can uh, see through his hand and shit. Oh, uh, okay. That guy. Okay. Yeah. So you're voting him? Yeah. You just now found out who he was and you're voting for him? Yeah. Well, so, how did he win? Uh, I don't know. I'm just picking him. This, this person right here. Okay. I'm going to be honest. I, I, I hate Blade. I've only seen one Blade movie. And I, I thought it fucking sucked. I saw Blade 2 and it's it was horrible. It's long and boring. Everybody's like, you need to watch part one. Yeah, I really need to watch part one. Is it going to change my mind? Is, am I going to be like, holy shit, I, I admit that this is the greatest thing ever? No, probably not. I'm sorry. I, I'm 31 years old. I'm pretty good at judging a book by its cover. I am 99.9% .9 right every time I do it. But it's people rough. say never judge a book by its <laughs> cover. So, anyways, I, I hate Blade. And... From Dust Till Dawn is my favorite vampire movie ever. Quinn's my boy. QT is my boy. However, we're going character versus character. Blade. He's a fucking badass with a samurai sword. Against Quentin Tarantino, which let's, let's face it, as a vampire he didn't last long. He didn't last, he didn't do much damage. So, uh, I, I gotta go Blade. I hate to. I fucking hate to. I really hate to. And Ross, you're my boy. You know that. It's not personal. I, I hate Blade. <laughs> that movie is so horrible. Uh, but if I'm going based on they're both in the ring, they're squaring off. This guy Blade. Before Richie knows what the hell's going on. <laughs> Diced up. Chopped his head off. All right, the next match. Uh, Radu from the uh, Subspecies uh, series. Thrown in there by the uh, 13th Wolfman. Going up against Claudia. Kirsten Dunst from Interview the Vampire, which was starting her by Maya. Hey. Alright. Okay, I've only seen one subspecies movies. Nice. I saw uh, Bloodstone. I think it's part two. And um, I watched it when I was a kid. And honestly, the reason I bought it or rented it was because it had the Full Moon logo. <laughs> the Puppet Master fucking series. You know, you don't know about the Puppet Master. Like, every old Puppet Master had the full moon. So I associate full moon with Puppet Master. And I love the Puppet Master. I'm like, I'm going to get this. And I really liked it. I thought it was a damn good movie. I don't remember much of it. Like, if you were to give me a blood species quiz right now, I'd fail miserably. Or I'd get, I, 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 if I if I pass, it'd just be luck. So, um, however, it's a little girl. Like, I don't care how long she's been around. She's still a little girl. And like, if I remember correctly, Rad Dude's a bad motherfucker. Like, this dude was like the the Kingpin, the Dracula, if you will, in his era. Uh, I gotta go Radu. I'm going Radu. Sweetie, Radu versus Claudia. Claudia. Going Claudia. Now, now, she explained how Claudia is going to win the entire tournament to me. Now, I want her to explain to you guys at home. Sweetie, how's Claudia going to win this first match? Um, she's going to offer him dead bodies. So she's going to lug a dead body to the ring that's been dead already for a little bit and hope that they're dumb enough to be like, oh, is that a fresh kill? And they're going to drink the blood, and they're like, oh no, it's been dead for a while. Oh. And then she's going to win that match, and then come back next week for the Final Four with another dead body. Hope that no one else watched the previous match, and be like, here, here's another dead body. I freshly killed. It's have a pre-match drink. And then they're going to drink it, and be like, oh no, it's been dead for a while too. And then they're going to throw. Or, or, then, or, or, 
She's gonna bite him. But they're vampires. Bigger. No, she's gonna break his neck. I, I bet she will. So there you go, Randy versus Claudia. Um, up next, we got Dracula. Who threw him in there? The movie Phantom. That guy's a dick. But it's not who you think. This Dracula is Leslie Nielsen from Dracula, dead loving it. Going up against Jerry Dandridge, Chris Sarandon from uh, Fright Night. Sweetie, I'll let you go. Dracula versus Jerry, Jerry Dandridge. Jerry Dandridge. All righty. I, I'm all, I threw Dracula in there, I threw, but make sure it's Leslie Nielsen. It's who it is. It's Leslie Nielsen. It's, it's not... It's not Bella, it's not Christopher Lee, it's not Gary Owen. It's it's fucking Leslie Nielsen. So he he slips on banana pill and like gets staked by accident. Uh, my vote was Jerry Dandridge as well. Like there's not even a contest there. Uh, and Jerry Dandridge was thrown in there by uh, DJ Boy 3275, new to the game. So welcome, my man. And I, and I voted for you. So <laughs> mine was just a sacrificial lamb. I just threw him out there. So uh, and then the final matchup, we have David. Kiefer Sutherland from the Lost Boys going up against Nosferatu. What was that Max Shrek from uh, Nosferatu? Count Orlock, if you will. Nos it's the one that's ball has like a big rat. It's it's silent movie. You would not know anything about it. I'm gonna do the other one because I don't. You're going David. Wait, and uh, which one's David? He was kid. He's a blonde one. He was like the leader of. He was the. Is that he wasn't. Lost Boys? Yeah, he wasn't the head no, the vampire, but he was the, like the leader of the gang there. Nosferatu. That's from the movie Nosferatu. That's what I'm gonna pick. You're going Nosferatu. Yeah. Okay. Uh, and Nosferatu was thrown in there by uh, the man with no name. Uh. Once again. Are you sure the man with no name? Yeah, it was the man with no name. I thought it was Lynch. No, Lynch threw in. Um, Richie Gecko, I didn't mention that, yeah. Um, my brother Lynch Ramsey threw Richie Gecko in. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Have to mention his name, shit. Uh, no, man with no name threw in Nosferatu. Um, it, it goes back to the Richie Gecko match, though, where even though I like the character David way better than Nosferatu, man, that's ancient evil right there. Like, this guy, I mean, granted, he's stupid enough to stay out in the sunlight. The guy's been around for centuries and forgets to get home before 6 a.m., but whatever. Um, but, David, dude, I don't know, man. That's a tough one. I'm going to go Nosferatu, but a part of me wants David to, to win. Like, if, 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 if Nosferatu gets shot down, if he gets voted down, I won't, I, won't, I won't cry. I won't cry at all. I'll be like, yay, David. But I feel like Nosferatu, uh, he's older. He's wiser. Well, I don't know how wise he is once again, he got caught out in the sunlight but he is older and I feel like uh, you know David's still a kid at heart even though he's been around for a little bit he's still he's all about partying and you know uh, yeah I'm going, I'm going Nosferatu that's who I'm going so recap of the matches we got Blade versus Richie Gecko, Radu versus Claudia Dracula versus Jerry Dandridge and oh sorry David versus Nosferatu so guys you know what to do the votes here don't matter it's all about you guys at home. So get those votes in. You know what to do. Video response, comment down below, Twitter, Facebook, however you want to do it. Just get them in. And uh, yeah, that's all I got. So what, you got anything else to add? I'll go check out my top three. Man, shameless plug for her channel. But do check out her top three. What's your top three this week? Duo movies. Duo movies? Yeah. Like two movies? Like Devil's Rejects and House of Thousand Corpses? No. Two, uh, what? Like the... Like team up people like like buddies 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 all right so that's all we got guys until next time